Hey y'all, here we are again at Hire or Fire. And today, we have four new contestants. Great for the job. Let's bring them in. Mr. Tony Peterson. There's my therapeutic pot, uh, putty. Do you want to touch it? Touch it, squish it. So, question number one. Are you good around people? Yeah. You been around people? Yeah. Uh, what was your previous job or is this your first job? I don't remember. I don't know. We don't take people that don't remember things! Now, do you know what job you're applying for? Yes. Tell me. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm gonna hit you in the head! Okay, you are applying. For a sewage clean out! I am? Yes. Okay. Have you ever had experience shoveling stuff? Yeah. I think it's lying. Okay. <clears throat> uh, do you have any experience with any other workforce other than this? Any? No. <sighs> what about any, uh... Farming experience? No. Where have you lived no. before this? Uh, under a bridge. Under a bridge, people. Um, why do you look in such good shape? I mean, do I? Not really. When did you leave the house? I didn't have a house. What state were you born in? This one. So you were born in Florida? injuries on work? No, I don't think so. Have you ever worked? No. How do you live? How do you get food? How do you get money? How do you afford those expensive glasses and earbuds? I don't. You steal. You steal. Well, that wraps it up for this show. Looks like this guy's gonna get fired. What is this? Um, next we have Drunk Celebrity. Who could that be? Anyway, Drunk Celebrity, please come in. <laughs> I've never seen someone. <laughs> that makes me want to chuckle. Sup? <laughs> Okay, so, sorry to laugh. Um, do you know what job you're applying for? Absolutely not. <laughs> okay, well, you're hiring, uh, you're uh, applying for a uh, sewage tank cleaner. Sick, man. Yeah, um, do you drink on the job? Absolutely. What do you wear to work? Underwear. <laughs> oh, okay, so... Uh, where have you worked before? Because it says you're a drunk celebrity. I forgot, man. Not usual. Okay, so I'm um, like, do you want to have the job? I don't know. Well, that looks like it's it. Uh,. Uh, let me go run this through the machine real quick. You can play with the therapeutic puppy if you want. Hello, sir. Uh, yes, he said he's a drunk celebrity. So, just got back. Guy I'm working for. Well, he said you're hired. <laughs> yeah. See, you find that very tasty. Um, he said meet him Tuesday, Starbucks down the road. Yeah, man. Well, thanks. <laughs> Come here next time. Oh my gosh.
Welcome back. You can see I've shaved finally. I know it got really gross towards the end, but anyway, welcome back to Fire or Hire. And today we're looking for an art studio. Art studio, yeah. Okay, so today's uh, uh, thing is sponsored by National Geographic. They got all kinds of books, kids, adults, anything, you name it. Okay, um, now, Mr. Ryan Shupin, please come in. Okay, so, I hear you're here to apply for the art studio. Am I right? Yeah, that's my son. Great. Now, an art artist has to have a good sense of humor. I want you to try to laugh, but if they're not funny, you don't get the chance. Okay, why couldn't the Cyclops family get along? What? Because they couldn't see eye to eye. <laughs> that no funny joke. Where do astronauts keep their sandwiches? Where? In their launch box. <laughs> that ain't so great, son. You got a dry sense of humor, boy. Okay, you gotta know when things are real or fake. Well, let's see. Earwax is a natural antibi antibiotic. Is that true or false? I don't know. It's false. Now, if you don't give me straight answers, I'm gonna kick your butt with that like the last guy. One type of owl in Australia barks like a dog. True or not? That's true. I think it is. What did you dream of becoming when you were a kid? I've always wanted to be a sheriff. Sheriff? But that ain't gonna come true, really. Nope. That's not true. if you get this job as an art studio manager. Now, you gotta be able to handle managers, other employees under pressure. Get that? So I'm gonna run you through a drill real quick. You ready? Help yourself to the therapeutic buddy. I've heard someone put this in the mouth. Yeah, that was the last guy, a drunk celebrity. Well, the boss says you're hired. You start Tuesday, you go get your uh, supplies Wednesday. This Wednesday, you start next Tuesday. Cool. Well, it's been nice. Remember, Welcome back. Today on Hire or Fire, we are doing trash truck. I know, I don't know who would hire me for a trash truck. I just do it. Okay, uh, bring him in. Uh, Seth Schultz. Hey Seth, how you doing? Good, how are you? Wonderful. Uh, so like, uh, hmm? do you know what you're applying for? Yes. What? I'm applying. Is a construction worker. If you do like, no trash truck. Trash truck. Trash truck man. Yeah. <laughs> then you must have gotten my note mixed up with someone else. Well, who cares? It's time to go. Um, have you done any work before this? Uh, yes. What? Light the neighbor. Oh. No, just tell me, would you? I got stuff to do. I'm burning daylight here. Well, I helped with a, with a lot of um. Trash, cleaning up community service. Oh, wonderful, 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 wonderful. So, free. Do you have a family? Like, are you married? No. Are you dating? No. Because that's what came in your letter. Huh? It said her name's. <laughs> hey! Out of here! Hey, no, 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 no! no! <laughs> okay! Okay! I didn't know you, you said that. You son of a. Okay! Mute that out, please. Uh, I think there are kids watching. Now, I gotta be able to compare to dirty jobs, so would you please quit it? Um, what grades did you have in college? In college? Have you been in college yet? Yes. Okay. For your grades, four years. Nice! I'm gonna go run this to the machine. Be right back. Uh, who took the therapeutic? That last thing, Cowboy, man! 
I'll be right back. So, boss says, you're not hired. He said since you had a degree in college, you need to look further upon the destiny. So it's time to get out. Fire. Don't you dare. Okay! 